<laughs> Sup guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's Tay Money here. If you're new here, it's Taylor. Yes, I have two YouTube channels. What the fuck is this? But let's get right into this video. As you can tell by the title, we are going to be finding out how to go from zero to 100 YouTube subscribers in one week. Now, I'm going to be listing four steps. Um, not four steps, like four tips of how you could do this. The first one is going to be Facebook groups, okay? Tip number one is Facebook groups. Facebook groups are awesome. Facebook groups are really how I managed to get my channel to go from zero to 100 because a girl was putting in work. So, like, pretty much what you do on Facebook in order to get these subscribers and to get, like, watch time, you more want to use it for watch time and for comments and for likes like that and just to get your channel seen by like other people um actually another thing you can start doing on your channel is actually having a shout out part in your video so whenever you make any new videos you give another youtuber a shout out and bam putting another youtuber in the spotlight can do a lot for their channel pretty much you have a i have 100 subscribers they have 100 subscribers two different people like two different view life people two different channels you know and then we're promoting in front of our people and then our people are like oh there's more there's another person similar cool let me go over to that person let me check that out you know that's how that works so shout out for shout outs with youtube like sub for subs and stuff like that they're good but to an extent because the sub for subs what facebook and youtube tend to do is they don't even count it anymore and they count it as spam it's like they realize that there's just a, like a flood of people out of nowhere following you they will count it as spam and automatically have some of those people unfollow you they don't even have to let the other person know they can just do it in their system and bam you that's why sometimes we notice that when we do do the facebook group shout out the sub for sub thing it kind of goes left because Tonight you get like, you're at like, you got all these, you got 10 new subscribers. Tomorrow, you're they're all gone. Yeah, and you're like, what the hell happened? So that's just why that happens. It's because YouTube wants you to be generically getting your subscribers. But that doesn't mean that the Facebook groups don't work. So what you could do is, say you make, I, for example, I made a video about manifesting. What I do is I go on my manifesting groups. Anyone want to know in some information about manifesting? Make that a post, post it out. They hit me up, they want to know more. Of course, I have a video already made, ready to be sent to them. They want to know how to manifest, so they're gonna watch the video and guarantee you got yourself some view time right there. I went from zero views to 50 views. I know that's not a lot, but the watch time is like 4,000, and I went from 0 to 50, and I didn't think I was going to get anywhere, to be honest. I was like, I don't think I'm going to make this watch time. I don't even think I'm going to get monetized, so like, but uh, I'm going to do it. <laughs> I'm going to keep it going because it's fine, but if you're really making a YouTube channel to mainly get monetized, you're going to be waiting a little bit because 4,000 watch time is a lot okay so shout out for sub for subs could really help i keep saying shout out for shout out sub for subs could really help so that was tip number one sub for subs like for like share for share watch for watch you know stuff like that really can get your channel out there to the world you know step number two is thumbnails and thumbnails is pretty much the cover art of your video the thing that everyone sees first so it is really important to have thumbnails i wish when i started youtube before i understood that i did a little bit but i didn't put like like i didn't have the best i didn't know what i was doing let's just say that so the point is you just kind of want to put some effort in your thumbnails make them have some color, pick a theme if you want to be aesthetic, if you want to be modern, if you want to have music, choose your thing and then make it look good because that is going to be the reason why people are even clicking your video. That's going to be the reason why you even got the view, why you even got your subscriber because the first thing they're seeing is your thumbnail. Okay, so make sure thumbnail looks good. Make sure it looks 
exquisite like you would you would watch it if you don't think you would watch it because the thumbnail doesn't look good then don't use it also that's another reason why the facebook groups are so good because with the facebook groups you can find other people just like you creating youtube videos and ask them for help and be like yo do you think this looks good do you think this is a better thumbnail than this thumbnail you know like and they'll give you their honest opinions i'm not gonna lie there are some facebook groups that literally don't respond and they're horrible but the majority of them have at least like you know they got some people in there who will respond to you with their honest opinion and help you out right do is make sure that when you're trying to go from zero to 100 real quick you want to make sure that you are posting very short videos i mean don't be like me and post 17 minute long videos you want to also make sure that you're getting your watch time and in order to get your watch time you need to make videos that people will make it past two minutes two minutes is the mark that youtube is like okay this person actually fully watch they they watch something that's what they consider a full watch you know which is at the two minute mark or the four minute mark or whatever regardless you want to make sure that people are actually getting to watch majority of your video and when you go back at your analytics you're not seeing that they're only watching like the first 10 seconds or by the time you get to the middle they're not watching so you want to make sure you're make, keeping it sweet and short and you're not dragging the video too long that's a very important factor because me, myself, <laughs> I, I'm guilty of doing that. I have 17 minute long videos, 16 minute long videos, but that's just because I like to talk and I don't care. But I also don't want people to be wasting their time, so I'm trying to cut that short. <laughs> okay, I guess that's all four steps. So that's all four steps of how you can grow your YouTube channel from zero to 100 really quickly without having to worry about you know getting those gaining the subscribers and then dramatically losing them trust me yes it might happen but once you're doing it the right way and organically it won't happen as often trust me be consistent and stay consistent because once you stay consistent you're gonna see it accumulating like crazy so like i said before check out the facebook groups join some facebook groups put in some input, talk to them, sub for subs, I was going to say shout out for shout out again, sub for subs, subscribe, you know, like for like, comment for comment, and just be really nice, you know, be nice, like, don't treat people how you wouldn't want to be treated as a YouTuber, like, help people out, if you see someone genuinely doesn't understand something, help them out, and you'll be surprised you just gained a subscriber, you know, every subscribe matters, because, you know it does and that's the whole point here is to go from zero to 100 so work on your thumbnails make them cuter make sure that content is shorter and sweeter make sure you have everything put together you know make sure we're not rambling and take advantage of those facebook groups instagram you know take advantage of the hashtags take advantage of all the places that you can put your YouTube videos out on and Reddit is definitely another one of those good places if you are doing like informative videos and answering questions that people really need help with. So thanks for watching my video guys. Catch you guys in the next one. Take money out. Yeah, I'm, about, I'm gonna go watch The Community. Such a good show. I watched The Good Place. Such a good show. But yeah, I'm out. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends. Leave a comment down below what you like for, to see me post next. Bye, guys.
people how you wouldn't want to be treated as a YouTuber. Like, help people out. If you see someone genuinely doesn't understand something, help them out and you'll be surprised you just gained a subscriber, you know? Every subscribe matters because, you know, it does. And that's the whole point here is to go from zero to 100. So, work on your thumbnails, make them cuter. Make sure that content is shorter and sweeter. Make sure you have everything put together. You know, make sure we're not rambling. And take advantage of those Facebook groups, Instagram, you know, take advantage of the hashtags. Take advantage of all the places that you can put your YouTube videos out on. And Reddit is definitely another one of those good places if you are doing like informative videos and answering questions that people really need help with. So, thanks for watching my video, guys. Catch you guys in the next one. Take money out. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to go watch The Community. Such a good show. I watched The Good Place. Such a good show. But yeah, I'm out. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends. Leave a comment down below what you'd like for, to see me post next. Bye, guys.